It's time for the artist reality. <laughs> This is Todd V, ToddV.com. Done? Yeah, I'm done now. Jay Edwards, BlackEyeArt.com. And this is another episode of Artist Reality. Hey everybody, we're so glad you're with us tonight. We have a special treat for you. We're heading out to a brand new gallery opening, and we love to see new galleries open right in our neighborhood. We Gallery. The We Gallery. More galleries, more art, more better. It's what can you say? It's going to be another stop on your art walk visits. It's going to be another reason to come downtown and check out all the local art and, you know, maybe buy some and take it home. Well, have you been noticing that every month there's a new stop on the art walk? Seems like it. I mean, it's just growing that has and growing. Anything to do with the artist reality? Mm, yeah, be. Anything else going on in J World lately? BlackEyeArt.com. I don't know if I mentioned that. I mean, you can go to the uh, Black Eye article, which is the Black Eye Art blog. Nice. See what's going on with me. I even give a little. Uh, behind the scenes to this show. Okay, cool. Let them know, you know, the insights, the thoughts. Nice, very cool. So, I mean, we got tons of fans out there. I'm sure they'd love to read that. Kajillions. Yeah. That's a technical term. I got that from Stephen Hawking's. Thanks for asking. So, I was just getting to it. <laughs> What's been going on in Todd World? You've been so busy, I haven't I, had a chance to see you, so. It's true, but very busy working on uh, a couple different projects. And uh, right now, I've actually gotten heavy into you know, working on the pieces of art for my museum show coming up at the Maslin Museum. Um, trying to think of what else I got going on. Have you on. been doing any painting? I was painting today, as a matter of fact. Having some fun, you can see it over there past the camera. I'm painting with my fingers. Well, when you get done with what you're working on now, you're going to need more canvas, so go to Akron Cotton Products. Check out Akron Cotton. They can't, the prices can't be beat. They can't be beat. And remember, you can always go to Twitter and subscribe to my Twitter feed and find out what's going on up to the minute. It's kind of like microblogging and you know we can say hey we're gonna be at such and such a gallery you can come over and say hi. Be on maybe this show. And you got the micro blog covered. I got the big blog got covered. The big blog covered. Try Why don't we go over and see the Wee Gallery. Alright. See you in a minute. Hi we're here at the grand opening of the Wee Gallery. Hi guys. Hi. hi. Can you tell us your names? I'm Karen Ludlam. I'm Aaron Ludlam. Okay, you guys are the owners of the gallery? Yes, we are. So, congratulations. The opening looks really good. A lot of people here. Thank you. Uh, what kind of uh, hopes for the future do you have? Well, I think I want to be a rock star. <laughs> and I keep looking in the classified section, but nobody's hiring for the rock star position. So, I don't know. So, art. Art. <laughs> okay, so more clearly, what are the... What are the what are, what are your goals for the gallery? May I? Yes, absolutely. Uh, the goals for the gallery is it's very simple, and it's about creating a community here in Akron, which is the same thing that they're doing at the Red Light Gallery, and it's, um, taking the local artists that are here, teaching them how to sell their art, how to market themselves, displaying them in a professional manner, and creating that community, really. Okay, that sounds great. I mean, that's... That's what we try to do, like you said, at the red light, and it's nice to see that catching on. Um, how about you? Do you have anything to say? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> no, pretty much, yeah, that, that's it. We just wanted, we wanted to bring in something new that maybe people hadn't seen and get people excited again because there's a huge amount of love for art in this area. And so to bring people back in and see something different and get them excited again and get people coming back down again, that, that's really, that's a, that's a main goal. Yeah. Are you guys going to be having uh, shows here? Yes, we will be. Uh, yeah, um, we're going to be helping Jill and Tony with the space next door. Which Mocha Maiden. The Mocha Maiden, upstairs Mocha Maiden, the gallery, upstairs gallery at Mocha Maiden, I believe is what it's called. And we're going to be working with the local universities and local artists and doing rotating shows through that space as well. Excellent. All right, well, thanks for talking to us, guys. I know you're busy on the grand opening. So great luck to you, and we'll see you again. Thanks for coming. In just a moment, we're going to be talking to entrepreneur extraordinaire Tony Trophy. He's the owner of the building that Mocha Maiden's in, the Wee Gallery, and Rubber City Clothing. So I just want to introduce him real quick before he gets here, because once he's here, I will not have a chance to speak again. Hi, I'm Tony Trophy, and what we're doing here tonight is we're celebrating the arts. Right here at the Wee Galleries, and wh who I have next to me here is my dear friend Deanna. Hello. And, and she is what we call a culinary artist. She's infused her creative passion and joy and zest and zeal for living 
and she's translated into an elegant fanfare that we come to know and love every day is Crave. So, Deanna, tell us a little bit about the, the muses that inspires your good works to hear it at the center of the historic district. Um, we're just uh, we're thankful to be a part of this neighborhood. Everybody here is full of energy and life, um, and it's, uh, they've, they've uh, breathed a new breath into this city. Um, we're incredibly excited to educate people and expand their palates. Um, we just launched our new menu, and we have our new neighbors, We Gallery. Um, nice compliment, art museum. Uh, a very eclectic neighborhood, and uh, um, we're just really happy to be here. Well, what'd you think? Pretty cool stuff. That's the Wee Gallery. That's how they do it. Want to check out the Wee Gallery? We'll pop up their website right here. Is it going to be up here, or is it going to be? It'll be right here. It's going to be here stuff in front. Okay. Well, back here, is all kinds of stuff is going on this week. Who knows? Look at you're like downtown Akron right now. Isn't that cool? Yeah, like wave to the people. So if I said something right now. You have I, that would be like a like a challenge to you, and you have to go and do it. So you could. I'm like, oh man, we're in the desert now. Whoa. What are we doing out here, Todd? It's hot. Wouldn't it be cool if we could land on the moon next? Mm-hmm. I'm the first artist on the moon. Houston, we have a problem. Okay, this is lame. Let's go. We have the no suits. Okay, back in the studio. Um, Sorry about that. No worries. So that was this week's episode of Artist Reality. Unless you had something else you want to talk about. No, I mean that's that's. <laughs> I wanted to get that out there. Just had that right here. And yeah. Just needed to come out. That's words couldn't have described it. I I agree. I like it though. The old fashioned telephone ring. Okay. I'm, I'm feeling it. Well, with that being said, this is Todd V. Todd v. Jay Edwards, BlackIR.com. This has been another episode of Artist Reality, and for this evening, I'd like to say au revoir. Stay real. You usually have another line. You like stay real, keep creative, or something like that. Keep it real, stay creative. That's see you next it. time. We'll see you next time. <laughs>